What is up, guys? Welcome to my third signing video in a row. Three weeks in a row, I went to events that had signings at them. And this week, it was Monster Mania Con. They put on an event in uh, Oaks, Pennsylvania. This is the first time that I ever went to the inside of this convention center. They did an outdoor convention um, a few years back when COVID was still a thing. So uh, this is the first time that I actually went into the convention center and went to this specific event. I'm very familiar with Monster Mania Con. I went to their shows in New Jersey a few times. Once I went to the one in Maryland. Um, and this is the first time that I went to their show in Pe uh, Pennsylvania. And I heard that it's very different. And it's that's absolutely true. The, the center that it's held at is unlike any of the other conventions. Um, this is actually a convention center and not in a hotel. Me and my friends had an absolute blast at this show. Very roomy, very spacious, which is always a good thing with conventions. Um, we're looking at you, Still City Con. You could learn a thing or two. Um, but I usually wear, just a heads up, I usually wear a gray shirt. And it has a pocket where I put my phone to film. I forgot my gray shirt at home, so we had to improvise. For the first two people that I met, I wore a bathrobe. Um, and tied my phone around my waist and then I felt really stupid because I could have just tied a sweatshirt around my waist and do the same effect but we're just gonna pretend that didn't happen um so I'm gonna tell you about each person that I met tell you a little story and their price the first person that I met was Hayden Panettiere from the movie Scream 6 she wrote Cameron then signed ba hey <laughs> Hayden Panettiere wow I don't know why that's such a tongue twister for me XO, XO, and then wrote her character named Kirby. I'm a really big fan of Scream 4. I said that in the last video. I love that there's the original trilogy, then hopefully the new trilogy. And then in the middle, Scream 4 is kind of its own thing. Um, and again, it introduces Kirby, which is one of my favorite characters of the entire uh, franchise. Um, she was $70 an autograph, uh, which I think is uh, about right. She's in a lot of stuff. But something that was a little strange is you had to pay an extra five dollars if you wanted an eight by ten from her table i've never run into that they, it's always free it comes with the autograph um but that's not gonna make or break it for me i did get a video of me meeting her as well hey how are you i loved you returning oh, but I, it's impossible to not look at you and think of malcolm in the middle that's just my favorite show oh of all gosh. time oh my gosh i love doing that, that the uh, mama brian, episode oh, the my brian God. cranston was the one who directed it and really he, um, is the one who cast me. He's oh, like, you're wow. so wrong for this, but well, um, but we'll let it go. And he and my mom played married. They were married on a soap opera called Loving. Wow, you learn something every day. That was awesome. I know, right? I love Mama and the, uh, Mama Mia. So that episode really, you know, yes. strikes home. You know. That's amazing. Thank you so much. Have a great day. Something that I also have to mention is I've been to a lot of these conventions, so I can kind of guess like. Um, the prices of each person and stuff like that but something that i've never been it's like a science that i can't get down is who's going to have a long line and who isn't because going to the show if you ask me is hayden panettiere going to have a long line i would be like hell yeah but there was only maybe five people in front of me and the longest i ever saw her line was maybe eight people not even ten so that's always just really surprising to me the next person that i met was judith roberts from the movie dead silence one of the scariest movies i've seen in my entire life it's kind of hard to see. She signed in blue right under her. Um, she didn't have a dark blue. She just had a light blue. Um, so I said, uh, screw it. Let's try it. Um, and it didn't turn out amazing, but it turned out fine. You can still see it. Uh, she signed and wrote a character named Mary Shaw. She wrote uh, right under the scary person herself. Um, but I promise you, in person, she's not half as scary. She was really nice. She complimented my bathrobe that I was wearing. Um, and I got also a video of me meeting her. Hi, nice oh, to meet you. you. This looks great. Thank you very much. It's yeah, so this, fun. I love it. It keeps me warm. Yeah. That's the one. And, and it's colorful. It Thank you very much. Good. Thank you. Yeah, I appreciate right. it. Yeah. This yeah. is just one of my favorite movies of all time. Like really? nothing, nothing prepares you for the ending. Right. When did you see it? How old were you? Way too young. Way too young. Like what? Um, do, what do you think? Probably like eight years old. Um, and it scarred me, but you know, that, that it that's all right. Ever it. since you went back to it. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. And this is like my, I, I show all, all my friends this movie and like the, just the ending just absolutely yeah, blows them away. It's great. Yeah. I love this movie so much. Yeah. Good, 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 good. But you look very lovely, colorful. Thank you. Thank you very oh, much. Nice, it's nice. keeping me warm. It beats a jacket. Right. Yes, it does. Mm -hmm. It's good for in here. Thank you. Yes. So, Do you want this color to match the other autograph? That'd be great. Yeah. That works. Uh huh. Okay. And then her, just her signature and then character name. That would be amazing. Yeah. Okay. Up here, do you think? Oh, uh, uh, what about? Will I rub this or is that okay? Um, I think that's from a while back because that's Bob and Bob's not here. Okay. I don't know. You want it like maybe right here? That'd or? be great. Yeah. yeah. I'm not picky at all. Okay. Thank you so much. 
Can you see this? I can see it. Okay. And that's important that you see it. Okay. Can you see that? I can or, see that. Wow. Oh, now I can. Yeah. You sure? Because yeah, I can. Yeah. Okay. No, that's fine. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Is that okay. All righty. I display it under a light anyway, so that it just shines. Oh, yeah. That'll look cool. Right. I was going to say, under a black light, I bet it would look awesome. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it would. Anyway, yes. Oh, that's amazing. Thank you so much. Lovely. It was Thank amazing you. meeting you. Thank it's you. great to meet you. She was $50 an autograph, which I personally think is a little steep. I was guessing, like, around the 40 range, um, but I, I guess everyone's prices are going up, um, including hers. Um, but yeah, she was really nice. Before I get into the next autograph, here's just a little tip that I do whenever I go to a convention. I have this um, 11 by 17 protector, that, I, but you can like fit in 8 by 10s in here and whatnot. I put everything that I brought into the uh, this one. What I do is I have, I just signed in silver. I signed in black just to see um, how it comes out because then if you turn it around, that's how it's going to look on the picture itself. So I kind of just, when I'm kind of color preparing, uh, which color is going to turn out the best. I do it on that, so there's a little life hack for you. So let's get into the next autograph, which is, of course, David Arquette from the movie Scream. I've had this Scream poster going for years, and honestly, it's almost complete. Um, unfortunately, the two people that I'm missing from it is Drew Barrymore and Courtney Cox, which, of course, are the two hardest ones to get. Um, but, like, of all the name people down here, I have David Arquette, Nev Campbell, Matthew Lillard, Rose McGowan, and Skeet Ulrich. He wrote to Cameron, then signed his really funky-looking signature, and then wrote his character named Dewey. He was $60 an autograph, um, but actually I'll get into that after the video that I show you. Hello, oh, oh, nice you? to meet you. It's such a pleasure meeting you. It's such you. an honor to meet Dewey, but I always see you as Sweet Johnny. So that's like the best <laughs> Thank episode you so of the show, much. dude. That was Hi. amazing. Thank I you for that. That's, it, that's just the best television yeah, show of all time. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah, especially yeah. with all the guest stars like you, it doesn't get much better. Sure. Do you want your name on it? Now, uh, uh, to Cameron? Name? Yes, if you could, that'd be awesome. Do you want uh, it anywhere specifically? Oh, I'm not, there's not that much real estate on there, so wherever right. you can squeeze in, I'm not that picky. Awesome. It was great meeting you. Have Such a great a day. Meeting you. Thank you. I did. I'm, it's all right. you, oh, really? Oh, you're yeah. awesome. Thank you. Yeah. So, like I said, he was sixty dollars an autograph. But if you wanted a photo with him, it was an extra forty. Um, I usually don't pay to get my photo taken with people just because um, I don't know. I, it's just like something on my phone. I don't want to spend money to get my picture taken. But sometimes the autograph, the picture is included with the autograph. So I'm like, hell yeah, let's do it. With this case, it wasn't, but he was nice enough to actually ask if I wanted a picture with him for absolutely free. I love you, Dewey. Thank you. So yeah, David Arquette is definitely among one of the cooler people that I've ever met at a convention. He was he was awesome. It was so cool to talk about Scream and My Name is Earl. But yeah, that's all that I have to show you guys. Um, I won't keep you for any longer. I might have one convention left in me this year. Um, probably not, though, just because, you know, they're a lot of money. Um, but we'll, we'll see. You never, never say never. Um, but thank you so much for watching this video. I hope to see you in another one. Bye.